on board, here board. Let's get this over with. <laughs> well, look who's here. New recruits? Well, <laughs> let's fuck some shit up. What have you done? I swear I didn't mean to do this. As you look upon the USJ and you see the carnage in which there are villains sliced to pieces, splattered, they turn blue from a lack of air. There are even some villains that uh, looks like they've been uh, inhaling nothing but ice cream for the past 20 years in one go. A little bloated, you could say. This way, there's a question like, why did you do this? Again, Izuku was like, I didn't mean to. Them seeing he's holding his head in pain, like, what's wrong? This is his voice. I can't <clears throat> place it, but this voice is, it's just... You're hearing voices. Yes! Uh, okay. And, and this, it's weird. As soon as I, I heard it, then my moves didn't work mine. I, I couldn't control my body as all, at all, but it felt like I wanted to, and I could, and I did, but I didn't want this. It's... Like something was controlling me, but I can't explain. Hmm. Interesting. Well, let's just uh, try to rationalize what has occurred. Is yes, everyone's looking at Izuku, seeing that yeah, this experience has affected him but they just like do we cover him Let's turn him in fear for our lives what do we do here as Momo she just walks up to him so you really didn't mean to do any of this no this voice I can't I, don't worry about a voice right now worry about mm, what are you going to say to the news reporters? What can I say? The story of Izuku being mind controlled somehow, it's. People don't really believe it, but considering that it's a quirk field world, it does seem possible. But they still had to keep an eye on him. How much of an eye? There are hero escorts to keep him from using his quirk when it is not necessary. It's not all my, it's actually Endeavor, Mirko, and Best Genius. For the obvious reasons. Uh, I'm pretty sure I'm well enough not to require no no sorry kid but we are gonna escort you home to school better be glad we allow you your privacy in the bathroom <gasps> listen Lola bunny excuse me you did not just say that what? As yes, you could hear the cracking of Mirko's knuckles as she's like, Would you like to say that again, bitch? Huh? Izuku is next scene with a bunch of bumps and bruises. With a tear just starting to stream down from his cheek. Without what you say. 
Oh, you ever? Did this make miracle again? That's right. Uh, he learned so fast. <laughs> I did nothing to deserve this. You were a smart ass. That's plenty of reason for me to kick your ass. Endeavors. You have a strong quirk. The only thing is, what you seem to lack is control. No, I can control it fine. It wasn't me that slard, but it was your quirk, your power, wasn't it? Yes, you did the gestures which initiated these actions. Yes. I, I did. And do you know how rare a mind control quirk would be? Uh, well, I, exactly. A quirk like that could tip the scales when it comes to power. A quirk that can control people. Let alone get them to use their quirks. Like you? Hmm. You see why we have uh, trouble convincing the media and ourselves? But seriously, quirks could be anything. You never know what a quirk could manifest itself as. True. I heard that you were a late bloomer from the grapevine, but still. So what I suggest we find your little puppet master. If we can't, we can't prove that you didn't mean to kill those villains. Oh, I'm sorry, but that is the truth. Damn, man, do you have to be that blunt? Oh, no, I could be blunt. More blunt. What? Yes, observe. If we don't find this guy, chances are you're going to prison. I was that for blunt. Now you have him terrified. Hmm, good. He should be scared. Seriously, as young as he is, he's... I doubt he's going to survive in prison. <laughs> What's that supposed to be? Hmm. There are a lot of movies to reference here. Hmm. Don't you worry about it. What you say? Just hope you f we find this guy. As yes, the whole announcement of the sports festival is underway, and they do get the two weeks. One thing is, Izuku can't be left alone unless it's private, private. So yes, everywhere he goes, those heroes are following him, and people are staring. They're asking themselves, is that him? Is that the one who killed all those villains? Some of them happy that someone put those villains out. The streets permanently. Others thinking, wait, is he a vigilante or something? Well, we have laws for a reason, <laughs> damn it. So, a mixed reception. Of course. But now we cut to Endeavor and Shoshu. So, it was truly that bad. You saw the pictures. Yeah. Pictures are one thing, but actually being there, seeing what was done to those. Hmm. It must not have been easy for you to see. No, it wasn't. So, pretty much having his head down and Daryl being Kratos is like. I want to comfort you, but... Uh, 
I kind of don't know how. I'm kind of late in the game when it comes to that. Expressing emotions. Besides brooding. When it comes to Miriko, she's just wondering, huh, do you really think someone could control this kid to doing all that? Ugh, all I know is if people knew how dangerous my quirk was, chances are I wouldn't want it anymore. No. Yeah. You wouldn't want your quirk anymore if people knew how dangerous it and to greater saying you were, huh? <laughs> no, of course not. Do you know how terrified people would be? That's a good point. It would probably be better just to be quirkless. And from a person's standpoint. I mean, yeah, a powerful quirk is useful on the, on the field, but for a citizen to have it, someone who hears voices, hmm, if anything, that's uh, very problematic, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, the preacher to the choir. But still, even if it was mind control, who would do it? Why? And if it is for the reason so they wouldn't want the quirks, so what? Would The person would just be a recluse since you can't get rid of a quirk. Wait, can you? No, no, that's ridiculous. Yeah, I thought so. But still, kind of doesn't make much sense. As now, yes, we cut to all for one in Shigaraki, who is missing one of his arms. He is screaming and yelling, like, why did you have him cut my arm? Of all the people, why did you let him hurt me? That wasn't part of the plan. I didn't expect him to slice straight through the Nomo. You were just in the way after words. This guy you hired to control this Izuku brat. Why? Why make this grand spectacle of pure carnage? Hmm. Why not? Huh? Think of it like this, young Shodoroki. What? Don't worry about it. If anything, think of it like this, how should I say it? When people learn of how powerful a quirk can be, they start to imagine the potential that one quirk has, the deadliness, the pure, raw power that has been gifted upon someone. Someone they don't know. Someone they don't trust. Hmm. And what well, if you have a quirk that wasn't as powerful? Uh, I. You would probably either rally against the ones. The, uh, you know, one with the power, and ally yourselves with the ones without to take out that greater power. Yeah, or you could ally yourself with the strong in hopes that 
you can reap the rewards of their potential. Then what are you planning on doing? <laughs> yeah, you witnessed what that boy was able to do. Why else? I want that quirk of his. <laughs> Imagine what I could do with it. If I got my hands on it. And tweaked it. If I made copies of it, one with healing, poison, paralysis, who knows? It could be very uh, versatile given the right. Hmm. You could say methods used. Isn't that right, Doctor? Still can't understand why you left the Nomu. Because Shigaragi here was hurt. Yeah, but don't you think that Kotagiri could have taken both? Perhaps. But Kotagiri knows that. Shiraki, my successor, it takes top priority over some little lab experiment that failed. Heck, it did not fail. All the thing we needed to do was get to All Might. We couldn't do that because of that brat. Either way, they have it, and we don't. <sighs> yes. A real shame. That he could live out to his full potential. Trust me, Doctor. I provide the resources, the funding and whatnot for your research and your creations. All you have to do is keep doing what you're doing and enjoy the fruits of your labor. That's very hard to do when you leave one of my fruits out to ruin. Well, they learn of its modifications. That's nothing to worry about. If anything, I kind of hope they do find out. It could be very interesting when you think about it. Hmm. Interesting. How? Well, someone able to give or take away a quirk could be very valuable. See, whichever side uh, controls it. You? Yes. Think about it. My quirk, my gift allows me to take and give quirks. If it were to me, I could easily supply the whole world with quirks and give them enough time. <laughs> if anything, I just have to find some near death participants. Easy peasy. You're crazy. No. I'm not crazy. I'm realistic. As yes, that is how that ends. 
Izuku, still being monitored by heroes. He does his training without any lethal lethality in his techniques. Mirko actually wants to fight him or at least spar with him just because she's so bored from guarding him. The only thing is, bitch, she is in endeavor to, you know, it's bad enough we gotta take him on our patrols just to keep an eye on him, but still, no. We're not here to hurt him. Ugh. Gee, why are you such a pain in the ass? Why are you such a buzzkill? Are you not getting any at home? I'll take that as a yes. I. <clears throat> oh, sorry. Not so, not really, but sorry. Uh, don't worry. If anything, I'm sure your kids will be able to make you proud. No, you won't. Not so long as he keeps rejecting me. Really? And you know what caused this rejection. I didn't put that scar on his face. No. But you scarred something else for him, didn't you? I, uh, didn't you? father husband but but what as yes endeavor walks off Mirko and Bashius is pretty much huh Interesting. Very interesting turn of events. He didn't try to blow me up. He didn't try to retaliate or anything. I I have beaten the unbeatable. I have slain the beast, which is his ego. For at least a little moment, but still. A win is a win in my book. Now about that sparring match. Izuku's looking at me. He's all nervous and everything. Wait, why are you blushing? No reason. Considering that Mirko's hero costume is... Eh. I'm surprised if we haven't seen Mineta try anything with Mirko. Oh wait, she kicked his ass. Literally. But... Because of them fighting, Izuku doesn't really hold back per se. He just doesn't use lethal tactics. Because the Mirko, she is getting more and more bored with him half assing it. Do you really think you're going to be a hero with such weak power? Wait, what? Yeah, seriously. Could you imagine if I held back against my villains? Well, I think the hospital bills would be less. True, but then they wouldn't get the message not to fuck with me. What? Come on. Fear works. Oh, you don't use too much of it to the point where people would rather be allies with the bad guys just to get you out. But still, you know... It's a process. Huh. Think of it like this. Say you're a river. Okay. And this river starts to face some intervention from animals, rocks, Plants, etc. But then it starts to branch off to other things. 
think of this as you having a problem, but with, instead of dealing with it, you're causing more every time you just say, I'm okay. It's okay if you're not, but still. Is it good just... Hmm. Can I train with you again? Sure. If anything, just don't bore me. <sighs> I'm missing out on a lot out here all worried because of you. <sighs> and I need to fight something. Anything. As long as it's evil, I will face it and break it. You are a fight-aholic, aren't you? Thank you for the compliment. As then, Endeavor shows back up, but this time he's... Oh, my first swim. Flashback in which he gets pushed into a pool by Natsuo and Shoto. <laughs> still can't believe this. What? My son. He has a quirk now. Yes, so? Don't you think that's suspicious? Well, I, I guess... It would make sense for you to believe that, but at the end of the day, it's just probably a short circuit, you know? Hmm. I guess you have a good reason, but be mindful of your surroundings. Right. What the... Who was that? Wait, my son, your son? No, no. That's weird. And, uh, what, Izuku, are you alright? Huh? Oh, right, um, what's going on? We're about to start the race for Sports festival, man. D seriously. Oh. Oh, right. Sports festival. Oh, man. I forgot all about that. I am so sorry. You forgot? Yeah. We're in the middle of the race. And you forgot you were in a race? How does that work? Ah. Uh, uh. No, oh, never mind. If anything, at least you're. Uh, you're. Uh, paying attention, I guess. When it comes to the race, he's a good win, hands down. He pretty much literally blows past everyone. Bongo is pissed! Because with all this air, pretty much. His sweat is. Uh, Flying every, up everywhere before he can even really ignite it. And when he does, it sends off a bullet rage of explosions. When it comes to Shoto, yeah, since he's using ice, the only thing is he's a good quirk. Only really is just an inconvenience. When it comes to the cavalry battle, Izuku shields his team and. Uh, He's like an air dome or air hmm, sphere. Pretty much making sure that no one gets in. Even though, yes, he could make it so it chops something off. He just makes it so it's just a tornado. Trying to be more kid friendly for all the people watching. Especially his mom, who has heard of his unfortunate circumstances. 
though she does somewhat blame herself, she's also like, there's no way my son could do that of his own free will. Now, for the fights. Izuku wants to get this over with, so he does heed Ojo's warning and one shots. Poor, poor Shinso. When he goes to pretty much help Shinso up, he talks to him and answers a question. This causing him to pretty much brainwash Izuku into hitting himself. Everyone is looking at Shinso now. And upon seeing that, yes, he has a mind control, you know, brainwashing quirk, they're starting to believe more of what Izuku is saying. So it's kind of like. Oh. Hmm. So those quirks are a little bit more common than we thought, aren't they? You guys don't think he's the one that did? No, no, of course not. I mean, he's a student. He, wait, why would he? Well, unless there's a traitor in your way, maybe. As whispering starts to go around over and over again, people start to think Shinzo was the one who controlled Izuku, who slaughtered the villains, and now everyone is worried. Shinzo is hating this. He wants to be a hero, of course, and... This is not helping at all. Izuku seeing this, seeing the anger, the sadness, heartbreak in Shinzo's eyes is pretty much, okay, okay, that's enough. Shinzo had nothing to do with the USJ or anything that happened in it. He used his quirk on me, yes, but I don't remember what I did. I mean, I felt like something hit me, but I don't know. So you have no recollection of what happened. Right. And what's, that was the real big difference between this time and the USJ. Yes. At the USJ, I was fully aware of what I was doing. I just couldn't control myself. Okay. Okay. Brainwash boy gets to live another day. Cool. Cool. But we're still looking at you through a microscope. I'm fine with that. When it comes to the internships and, you know, ah, I'm just kidding. I'll say that for later. Let's get to the whole... Tano Jutsu get show to use the fire. It works. Only thing is, it was bad enough when Shinzo was using the ice, but adding fire to that, no Izuku can technically redirect it. If he's not careful, he's just going to make it stronger. So he has to think outside of the box when it comes to using any attacks. To a point where, yes, he's just air slashing through glaciers as he makes a protective shield of pure air itself to shield the fire. It's almost like a final boss in a video game. One thing is, there's no dragon, but someone is spitting fire. Izuku wins by the hero. His teeth, mainly due to the whole backlash of making Shoto's final attack with fire even more powerful. He does feel like, wow, that was hella lucky. Now, down to Mr. Tin, Tinya. Uh, I need to get better pronunciations. But either way, Izuku, uh, we're, we're still going to be friends out of this, right? Of course, I would never, <laughs> a burst of air, he yeah, gets landed to the stands, and Izuku is the winner. Because of Bakugo, Izuku, he's going to enjoy this. 
but as it carries on, people start to notice something. You start noticing Izuku clutching his head, saying, the voices are back, the voices are back. Everyone panicking and running out of the stadium as fast as humanely possible. With quirks, without quirks, it doesn't matter. I am not dying here today. And Bakugo sees as Izuku is tearing up as then a blade of pure air is formed. It is completely visible. Is that, what is it, what are you doing? I'm not the one doing this. As yes, Izuku strikes at Bakugo and cuts him right down the middle of his chest. And with that, Izuku passes out this time. Paramedics, recovery girl, the whole nine yards are trying to help Bakugo. What was he? He's like, the cut's not that deep. What? Calm down, son. You know what? It's not that bad. If I, well, maybe you're gonna need some stitches. <laughs> stitches? What? Wait, am I gonna be asleep? Well, no, fuck it. I'm just gonna lay here naturally. You know, like, like my forefathers before me. Yeah, I ain't getting no damn stitches. I'll just let it be natural. Now. Now, we can talk about... <laughs> the air ships. I wish Izuku does get many, just not nearly as much as Shoto. Bago is a little pissed that he lost in the getting offers from other hero agencies from Izuku, but it's pretty much like, I know how to beat you. As pretty much, he just goes up to all my, like, train me. With a smirk on his face. <laughs> I mean, I fall on my eyes like, mm -hmm. Sorry, but you're going to choose someone else. I'm going to be too busy. What? Yes, I'm very sorry. Are you serious? Yes, I am. Bongo looking and seeing that Izuku is like, <laughs> Yeah, bitch, you thought. I can't believe you're actually... Oh my... Okay. Has anyone heard about any mind control villains out there? Nope. Uh oh. Sorry. So there's nothing about anyone who can have a. Wait. What if we just been messing up the phrasing? Huh. What if this person could change their look? Or something. No, 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 that's impossible. Isn't it? I can't quirk. Or practically unlimited possibilities, but still. To have the person be conscious every second of. Hmm. Very interesting. Maybe I should test this all in Yuzuku one of these days. Hmm. Holy time, Botel. Now, because of the staying incident, that still happens. Only thing is, Yuzuku ain't no dummy. And yes, pretty much alerts other heroes to follow him just in case. That way, if this is. Stain does get captured, they won't get in trouble. If he doesn't, oh well, the hero's tried. So there isn't much for losing in this case. Look at you, Ida. You have someone looking out for your ass. But he does beat the hell out of Ida for doing something so reckless and stupid. As yes it was. 
But Izuku just can't shake this nagging feeling that he's being targeted by this person who controls him. But the only thing that really matters is now is finding him and getting him to stop the bullshit. <laughs>